Wembley, an ocean of fans descending upon the stadium for what promises to be an absolutely riveting FA Cup final. It's Arsenal, they face Manchester United, and it's live on EA TV. At long last, the wait is over. A warm welcome to Wembley. This is Derek Ray, joined in the commentary box by Stuart Robson, and we're approaching kickoff time in what promises to be a spectacular FA Cup final. It's Arsenal taking on Manchester United. Well, Derek, as a youngster growing up, this was the day that every young footballer dreamt of. Playing in the FA Cup final, walking out in front of 100,000 fans at Wembley, broadcast around the world, it still brings a tingle to my spine. And I'm really looking forward to this one. Thomas Partey, number 34, Granit Xhaka, number 7, Mikhail Saka. Here are the starters for Arsenal. Aaron Ramsdale is the goalkeeper. Thomas Partey starts with Granit Xhaka in the centre of the pitch. And the focal point in attack is Gabriel Jesus. Well, Manchester United have chosen this particular shape. David De Gea between the posts. Jadon Sancho starts with Anthony out wide. And the centrepiece of the attack is Marcus Rashford. Potentially one to savour. Arsenal get this game underway. Gabriel. Granit Xhaka. Now Zinchenko. Gabriel. And Arsenal now find themselves in potentially a dangerous position. Well, here it is again, and I don't expect keepers to save everything at their near post, but I think he should probably do better. He'll be a little bit disappointed with that. So back in action, and it's up to United now to be inventive. Well, couldn't find a teammate, unfortunately, and a throw in to come. Alexander Zinchenko, and the emphasis is on creativity. Partey. Now with Jesus, magnificent challenge to win it back. Jaden Sancho, and here is Malassia. Sancho, Rashford. Will they get themselves level here? Wonderful chance, terrific piece of anticipation. Short corner favour. And cut again from the flank. Rafael Varan. Eriksson. 
the attack carried an initial threat but fizzled out Saka Ben White Arsenal have given it away Anthony Bruno Fernandes well, just the tackle that was needed Gabriel Martinelli it's with Gabriel Alexander Zinchenko Farce on the offensive and it's Gabriel Jesus the supporters want to see him have a go superb block Possession lost, intercepted. Inching towards the half-time interval, it's Arsenal in front. And Stuart, how about your thoughts on their performance to this point? Well, I think they've been the better side in this first half. They've defended well, they've looked dangerous in attack and they've controlled the midfield. It's been a solid performance so far. Corner awarded to Manchester United. And over from Ericsson, able to deal with the threat. Thomas Partey, Arsenal pushing forward with options available, but nothing comes of it. Bruno Fernandes. Christian Eriksen now. Bruno Fernandes. Still trailing, but they're upping the pressure. Fernandes, the defender doing his job. Excellent block. Well, there we have it. We're at the halfway mark now, here at Wembley. So back underway with United looking to plot a route back into this game. Ben White. Arsenal move it forward with purpose and control. Well, the fans really want him to shoot. And it's Gabriel Jesus. He must finish, and a goal! I'll tell you what, they're going to be very hard to catch now. Name on the trophy, maybe. Just look at this again. The combination play in the top third of the field was so precise, and it makes the striker's job so easy. All he has to do is make the right connection. It's a lovely goal. So back underway with the lead standing at 2 0. Jaden Sancho. Christian Eriksen now. Jaden Sancho. Rashford. Sancho now. Bruno Fernandes.
throw in to Manchester United. Here's a change for Manchester United. To be replaced by. Jaden Sancho. Well, that's how to do it inside your own penalty area. Ben White. Thomas Partey. He continues his run. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Cristiano Ronaldo. Intense pressure. Oh, fine play, and maybe it'll set something up. Sancho. Can he get one back? Oh, no, is the answer. It was a guilt-edge opportunity. He couldn't avail himself of it. You have to say that's a big chance missed. He had to score there. That makes it difficult now. Granit Xhaka Martinelli Xhaka with it Zinchenko Is this the moment? And there it is! Another goal! And surely there's no way back from this now! Well, here's the replay, and he shows great awareness to play this through ball. And the finish is clinical. He just makes it look so easy, doesn't he? Well, on they go again. Arsenal very much in charge. It's turning into a right old thrashing. Turning inside, where's he going to go? Oh, good reflexes from the keeper and the danger of Erzing. So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. And the short option preferred. Clean challenge. Ronaldo, Christian Eriksen might fancy it. Well, it didn't happen for them in attack. And it's Gabriel Jesus. Couldn't hang on to it. Scott McTominay. Here's Luke Shaw. Ronaldo. A real defensive commitment there. Granit Xhaka Kieran Tierney and it's Gabriel Jesus and a good challenge to bring that attack to an end out of play and an Arsenal throw in forthcoming there has been plenty of limbering up from substitutes and now both sides will make personnel switches And it comes down to the final five minutes. Tommy Yasu. Might be a chance here. Casemiro. Making sure nothing untoward happened. Saka. Now with Jesus. Well, the action is going to continue for a while yet. We will have four minutes of stoppage time. Well, he made that interception look routine. In truth, it wasn't. Cristiano Ronaldo. Sancho. Well, 
it all counts for naught. And there goes the final whistle. The cup issue is settled. A story of one side celebrating and the other distraught. Memories are being made. Well, just look at those scenes down there, Derek. What a contrast in emotions. Brilliant for the winners, despair for the losers. But overall, the right team won today. Yeah, you can see what it means to this tight-knit team. Real 